Welcome back to Blade and See. My name is Kamiv. Got Lucky King in the building. That's good. Uh, Shuriken Fight Series 17. Bro, UFC banger. Fight Pass. Banger. UFC 300. New Zealand version. Yeah, straight up. It's our version of UFC 300. It was. It was. It was really cool. And uh, this, I think, the first time we didn't go to watch yeah, Shuriken live. Live. Yeah. We watched it at home, and yeah. it was. It was great. You know. It was. It was dope. Still, it yeah. was awesome. Uh, there was some slip. Let me pull up the. Uh, oh shit! I opened the wrong one. Let me pull up the notes. Um, there was some slip ups you can see in the in the prelims, right? Like in terms of audio, the mic wasn't really there. Yeah, yeah. The lighting wasn't really there. Yeah. But then eventually, by the time they got like quarter of the way through, a couple of fights in, they fixed everything. Yeah. All the lighting was done. Uh, yeah. The audio was great. Um, commentary was good. Yeah. I never heard commentary before when we watched Hurricane fights. Yeah. It's the first time. It's pretty good. I call, yeah, commentary was, yeah. It was good, but also some... Uh, yeah. Like, well, I wasn't really paying attention yeah. that much. But then I wasn't every, paying attention to the commentary either. I was just watching the fights. Really. When, yeah. when uh, But when Nixon was fighting, there was a lot of... Uh, oh, was it Nixon? Oh, no. It was someone else that was fighting. There was a lot of jujitsu breakdown and... The guy that was talking, he, it sounded like he knew what he was talking about. Like I don't know much yeah. about jujitsu, but he knew all the, the uh, positions, the, yeah, yeah. what this guy needs to do to get out. He was like kind of breaking it down. Yeah. yeah, I think it was the Nixon fight when he was telling all yeah, this guy's got a butterfly yeah. guard or whatever. He's yeah, got to yeah. do this. He's got to put his arm here to get out. And he, it was good. It was good. You know, yeah. that was the only time I paid attention. Other yeah. than that, I didn't. But fuck it, let's just break down. Yeah. Let's go straight let's, into the fights. We'll start from the main cut. Work our work our way down. Yeah. Uh, main event. Brando. Versus Kelvin Fitian, the bear brother, the Balkan bear. Fuck. He was fucking scary, man. Brando, Fuck, bro. Brando was a scary guy. That that was some scary shit. Yeah, Brando came up, bro. Brando was so ready. Brando's been waiting for so long to fight. He said five years or something like that, right? No, for way. MMA fight. Oh, yeah, for right. MMA fight. But right. I don't know when his last kickboxing fight was. Been a while. Um, I never since been a while, I, yeah. since I seen since I've been at CKB, I never seen him fight. Yeah. Bando's never fought. Because it's hard. Like, he got matched up with quite a few times. Yeah, I know. They keep pulling out and Always. not wanting to fight. That yeah. one cunt, I don't know what the fuck his name was. He, 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 the, the guy in Fra France? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, the guy yeah. with the belts and shit. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Like, he wanted to fight Brando and all of a sudden, like, he said he was injured or something. He pulled out the fight and he fought someone else. And he fought, like, a really overweight fat <laughs> guy. Man. So stupid. It was fucking dumb. Yeah. But, yeah. But I'm, I'm glad to see Brando got the fight. Fuck, bro. Brando was on. He came out. You could tell he was just ready to he, he couldn't wait. He, he came to out. Boom, bro. I've never seen a big guy throw head kicks like that. Yeah. Brando is so athletic. It's crazy. Yeah. For, for for someone, a heavyweight, someone as big as him, he's so light on his feet. He's bouncy. He's fast as fuck. And he's explosive. And he's, like, athletic. Yeah. That, he can do spinning shit. Like, bro, he's... He, like, like he, he's... he's Yeah. Like Chris Barnett, yeah. you know, he does like, he can like do flips and shit like yeah, that. Yeah. yeah. So like you rarely ever see heavyweights do shit like that. Yeah. Brando's like one of those athletic heavyweights. Scary, That's what like, I'm saying. Kind of like Neville as well. He's, he's the new age of heavyweights. He's yeah. like the, the Cyril And he's God. only like 28. Yeah. 29. He's, yeah, he's yeah. quite young. I know, yeah. but he's like the new age. He's like the Cyril Gans where they're light and they're yeah, super yeah, technical yeah, yeah, kickboxers. Yeah, true, true. yeah, yeah. Big motherfuckers, but they don't yeah. fight like big dudes. Nah, you know what I mean? They nah. fight like lighter weight guys. 100%. Really skilled, really light 100%. on their feet. Yeah. And fuck, Brando was throwing those elbows. Yeah, man. those elbows you see, bro. Combination. <laughs> when I saw those elbows, I'm like, that's some scary yeah. shit. Like, the amount of fucking force. The fact it. that that Kelvin could eat those and not yeah, like get rock. Yeah. yeah, Kelvin's a tough dude. He that's a, a tough, tough dude, man. Yeah. That's a tough guy, bro. Um, yeah, Brando was letting those elbows go in those clinches, those tight, you know, uppercuts yeah. in there. And you could see even when um, when when if, when Kevin reversed the position, Brando doesn't settle at the back of the cage. Yeah, yeah. He pushed him off, clinched him, kneed Knees. him, let those uppercuts go. You yeah. know what I mean? He won't settle at the cage, and yeah. I think that was dope that I I, I to to see Brando do that because a lot of guys when they get reversed, they're like, okay, let me just they'll try and hold, they'll try to hold yeah. and try and work. Brando, Brando pushed him back up, clinched him, you know what I mean? Didn't give yeah. him that, that, that space to, to hold him back in the cage or, or even try to like play the cage wrestling, you know what I mean? Yeah. I think that was dope to see. I, I feel like I want to try it. Like, not try, I mean like, I, um, I think that's a good good thing for MMA guys to try, you know what I mean? Make, it, reverse, make it hard. Yeah, make it hard. Like, don't yeah. don't just give up that. Don't just get, let him, okay, let me let him reverse me. Because a lot of times you see, yeah. like they just let them, like kind of almost let them reverse. Even though I know it's, it's a hard position, it's difficult. It's tough when someone's turning you. Yeah. But don't settle. Like, kind of push them back. You know, push them off you. Or, yeah, or yeah. push into them and push them back. 
so they don't don't get you to the cage. But Brando did that really well, man. That yeah. was dope. He kind of like shoved him a little bit, grabbed that, grabbed his neck and threw those knees. Yeah, those knees were fucking gangster from Brando. But like Kevin, then, this bro. motherfucker, he is smart. He knew <laughs> what he was doing. We watched it back. Like, yeah. this, he put his hand in between Brando, yeah. like he felt the cup and then kneed him right there. Because <laughs> that, that knee, it was it was crack up because he was like he, he when he, when he hit Brando against the cage and then I saw him put his arm. We, we, we watched it. His arm was like by Brando's cross, pretty much by his dick. Yeah. He put his arm there, he felt it, and he Boom. just threw that knee right. The knee was just like, thunk, yeah. <laughs> straight right where he went. Was. He went straight for it. He wanted to knee him. <laughs> but no disrespect to Kevin, we yeah. don't know if it was. Yeah, like, yeah, to nah, me, nah, it looked fair, intentional. Fair, yeah, yeah. It looked intentional, but I don't know if you intentionally yeah. did it. In the moment, you never know. You he know did it mean? twice. But, twice, yeah. Yeah. So that, that first one, I'm not going to lie, it kind of looked intentional, yeah. to be honest. Yeah. To be honest, it kind of looked intentional. But yeah, because it, it didn't look like he was trying to pick his knee higher up to high enough. Body. Yeah, he just it was like, just like a little <laughs> straight up to the yeah. But, like yeah. that was fucked up. That gotta hurt, bro. Yeah, and and you know, Brando's not the type to just you know like purposely all oh, you know like yeah, fuck. Yeah, nah, you know that already. Yeah. Like fuck, he's winning the fight. Why would he want to do that? So yeah, that happened, and then yeah, came back again. He's you know Brando still did his thing. Like yeah. those one twos as well. Fuck, bro. Head kicks. He was throwing yeah, a lot his of head, head kicks. kicks. Was they weren't landing clean because he, he yeah, had his he, hand up. Yeah, but still, like he was kicking. Like Brand, imagine Brando kicking. Even if your <laughs> fucking hand is here, I right? felt Brando kicking the ball. <laughs> yeah. lightly. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot you spotted him. Yeah, yeah. Brando beat the shit out of you, brother. <laughs> but, yeah. but yeah. No. Um, <laughs> nah, um, well, yeah, how and, did Brando get him down? Uh, and I think, I think Brando was like piecing him up against the cage. No, and he I think, fell down. I think, think he, he shot and took him down. Maybe. Oh, did he like I hit think, an arm? Yeah, I can't remember how that happened. I think yeah, I think he was. He got him down. And he choked him. But yeah, either that or or maybe he reversed the position. I can't quite remember. Yeah. But how that se- the ending sequence went. Yeah. Um. But yeah, we know he, he finished him with um rear naked choke. Yeah, he tapped yeah. immediately. Immediately yeah. tapped. He knew. Yeah. He knew. He's like, I'm getting fucked up. Yeah. I, yeah. Yeah. This was just his way out. Exactly. Know, yeah. I don't think, maybe, I don't know, if we speak to Brando, we can ask. But it didn't yeah. look like Brando really sunk it in. It's most like, yeah. almost looked like he got it before he could even like do anything. That guy was like, ah, okay, okay, yeah. chill, 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 I'm done, I'm done. Maybe, yeah. yeah it looked, yeah, it it kind looked, looked like it. Yeah. It looked like it, yeah. And yeah, to be honest, like it was... Bro, he would have just gone. A yeah, bad Brando would have been like. Even if he escaped the fucking rear naked, he would have just gone smashed. Yeah, imagine down. Brando on top of you, yeah. fucking swinging, bro. Elbows, fuck. elbow. Fuck. He was elbowing, standing. Yeah. No one fucking did that. The whole, yeah. all, the whole car. No one yeah. standing elbows. Yeah. Imagine ground and pound elbows. Yeah. Brando would have fucked tore that. his face apart. Imagine Brando's elbows, bro. Yeah. Fuck that shit. But um, yeah, man. What can shout you say? Shout out to Brando Bear. Yeah, shout out to the bear. What can you say, man? Balkan Bear. He's, He's, a fucking He's fighting in two weeks. He's fighting again in two weeks. Hex. Yeah. Uh, when's Hex? May May f- May fifth. May fourth. May May. I think May fourth. Seventh. Oh fuck! I, don't I know. think it's seventh. But May something. It it's yeah. next. It's in two weeks. Yeah. He's headlining Hex as well. Yeah. Let's go. I feel like Brando. Yeah. Hopefully after the hex, you know he's, he get that dub in hex and maybe you know he can can. How many he, how many fights has he had in MMA though? Not a lot. Will be five, six. Will be seven. Oh shit! Okay. Hex will be his number seven. All finishes? I think so. I yeah. think he's seven and zero. Oh. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. Right? I think he's undefeated. In MMA. Yeah, yeah. I'm pretty sure. I think he had well, one or two losses in kickboxing. He had like twenty two fights, one loss. He had like like yeah. a very and seventeen knockouts. Yeah. I think I remember yeah, him yeah. saying. Yeah. yeah. I think he's five and zero. Oh. I think he said five MMA fights. Yeah. I think it's five and also it'll be seven, and hopefully he can knock on the UFC's door, man, to heavyweight because no one there's so there's not many heavyweights that want to fight out here. Yeah, he's been trying to get fights for so long. And UFC needs heavyweights as yeah. well. Yeah, and, and especially heavyweights like him that, yeah. that you know that that uh, that that bring that heat. You know what I mean? That bring yeah. that excitement. You know what I mean? So Brando's definitely one of those guys. And yeah, yeah, I can't wait to see the Balkan Bear next, man. Running it back again in two weeks. Yeah, and we're gonna be there live. So yeah, let's we're not go. missing that one. We're not sure. fucking yeah. missing that shit. But yeah, yeah, shout out to Brando. Shout out to Brando. Uh, and then the next one was Gina G fought Gay Sanita. Gay Sanita. Uh, Gina got submitted in the second round. Yeah. But, but she was piecing her up. Like yeah. Masterclass on Clean the performance yeah. throughout. Not yeah, a throughout single, round one. Yeah, throughout round one. Yeah. Not a single scratch. Super clean distance. Those 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 um doubling up and tripling up on those hooks was fucking nice, bro. Yeah. Pop, 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 pop. Like, yeah, Gina's just doing what she does, man. Like, super sharp. Like, I feel like she came out super sharp, man, to be honest. Yeah. In the first round, just touching her up the whole the whole fight and managing the distance really well. 
Excuse me. And then um and then I think but but she had a lot of output in yeah. round one. A she started lot. to get tired in the second round. Yeah, yeah. Because she had a lot of output in, in the first round, even moving around and just a lot of output. So I think maybe she might have just um uh blown the load a yeah. bit too quickly. How did I see? I keep I keep I have very vague memory. I don't know how. Yeah, fuck, I can't remember. Yeah, either. how did there were so get, many fights were just yeah. losing our mind. Um, um, but Gase got it down and immediately sunk yeah. it. So because apparently Gase is going to be uh, competing in the ADCC for yeah, Thailand so I think Jiu Jitsu is her Jiu Jitsu is yeah, a game, her, right? Her Wrestling game, is yeah. her thing. But she couldn't really get to Gina. Yeah, she couldn't because Gina's Gina. distance was so good. Beautiful distance. Jab, man. fucking bl- cut her open. You know. Yeah. Like, but as soon as she was able, I think she shot. Yeah, I'm pretty sure she shot. I feel shot. like as soon as she shot, she yeah, got it. Yeah, I think Gina, Gina was already already signed. Getting uh, tired. She was backed tired. up against the fence. Yeah, you know? backed yeah. up against the fence, and I think she got the takedown there. Yeah, yeah, she got it immediately. You know? Yeah, and she shot, took it down. She got her back. I think she got her back while Gina was standing still. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like she was like against the fence standing, and she yeah. got the back. I think so. I can't quite remember. Yeah, but I, I know she, she she choked her out. But um, yeah, still a really good performance from, G, uh, from Gina, and also from uh, Enchato. Uh, is it Gase? Gase. Gase Anita. Anita. Yeah. Uh, good Good on her, you know. I mean, she she kept up. Yeah. You know? Oh, Gase's coach was that um the Instagram guy. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, fuck, I, what I, is I don't know his name. He's got his. It's a very like I don't know Armenian kind of name or I don't know what countries were maybe Italian. I don't remember his name, but he has a lot of good uh, yeah it, it, like instructional yeah, videos. His, yeah, his, yeah, his his um just his his uh when he's giving knowledge and shit like MMA that, stuff, yeah. good MMA stuff. Yeah, man, you can tell this guy's switched on, man. Yeah. Like, and uh, yeah, he, he's he's um, Percy. Is it Percy? I don't know his name at all. Uh, I've no, just they, seen they, his videos. You seen the guy that did the standing choke? Yeah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. The standing. Um, I don't know what it's called. The Percy. They call it the Percy choke. Yeah, yeah. Percy No Mercy or something. Yeah, I yeah. think that's his name. Um, yeah, Percy. So that's his his student as well. Right, right. And then the, uh, there's another guy with the dreads. Um, the white boy. I forget his name. I fucking need to get their names. He's fighting in one championship. Oh shit! Yeah, yeah, he's MMA. one. Yeah, MMA. Uh-huh. Yeah, so um, I forget his name. How can I? I I remember his name, but I forgot. Percy, I remember. Percy's yeah. good. Yeah, but that's alright. But yeah. yeah, shout out to them. They're in yeah. Australia. I think they're in Australia. Um, so yeah, good fight, good fight by Gina, and shout out to Gates for the dub. Well yeah. done, good job. And then uh, next we have. John Vake fought James Crowell. Yeah, John. Yeah, John Vake, James Crowell. Yeah. Let's go. John, Big docs, bro. John Big docs. Back and uh, what y'all talk about? Two divisions up, bro. That's crazy. Two fucking divisions He's up. He's a welterweight. He fought light heavyweight. Yeah. That's crazy. He could stand and bang. No, he didn't just just shoot. He yeah. stood and bang. And obviously, he went to where he's good at wrestling, but yeah. he can still stand and bang with anyone. John John has fought. This is not the first time he's fought a light heavyweight. He's fought a light heavyweight before. Yeah. He fought the Asian guy and he knocked him the fuck out. No, yeah, he knocked him and, and ground and pounded him. Like, he yeah. caught him with that left hook. Two to the body came on left hook. Boom. Yeah. Dropped him and then ground and pounded him and finished him. Yeah. And that guy, that lad heavyweight guy, is currently in the UFC. Who? Uh, the Asian guy. I forget his name. He's um he's a light heavyweight contender in UFC right now. Oh, shit. And John beat him. Fuck. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. A lot of people don't know. Know your history. You all better fucking do some research and find that out. What the fuck you know about John Vake? That's crazy. I didn't know. Yeah. Who, what's the guy? What's the guy's I forget name? his name. We'll find his name after. We'll find his name after. Okay. Uh, ooh, um, we might as well look it up now so we can actually oh yeah, so, talk about yeah, it. Yeah, I can um, talk about it. What the fuck is his is name? Is he in the top 15? Uh, Probably top 15. Uh, Yeah, probably top 15 or like in the top 20. If he's not in the top 15, then we won't we won't be able to find him. But let's go to John Vake's record and have a look. You can get his name. I hate how you can't look at the. Is it Jun Yong Park? Jun Yong Park. That sounds like the guy that that Carlos. Pichas oh yeah, beat. yeah, yeah. I think it's that guy. Yeah. Is that who John? Oh beat? no 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 no. I don't think it's Jun Yong Park. No, my bad, my bad. No. That was a while back. All right, I'm I'm looking up John John Park. Um. Yeah. Maybe J J. Oh shit! John's fifteen and eight. He has a lot of fucking fights yeah. in MMA. <laughs> what the hell? I had no idea. Maybe maybe I think his name might have been uh, this guy. Oh no, not him. Yeah, he fought Jun Young Park, but he lost. No no no, it's one. not it's not that guy. No. 
Then there's Liu Hanan. Ming Yang Zhang, I know that name. Oh yeah, left hook and punches, that's the one. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the one. Yeah, Ming Oh Ming this motherfucker. Oh yeah, Ming Yang. Oh, <laughs> this guy. I know this yeah. guy. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. This guy right here, yeah. Oh shit. So he beat he beat him. Look. He beat He's in the tear, brother. Look yeah. at him. Holy fuck. When did he fight John? Oh, it was his like f- few fights in. Yeah. But that okay, anyways. So John Wait, where is um the Yes. So what the fuck you know about that? John Vake fought Ming Yang. What was his name? I forget. What was it Ming? It's alright. It's alright. Doesn't matter. Ming Yang Zhang. Ming Yang Zhang. Ming Yang Zhang. Yeah. John Vake knocked out Ming Yang Zhang, John. who's in the UFC currently. Currently, yeah. And he's on a winning streak as winning well. Winning streak That's right crazy. now. Yeah. So that just tells you who John Vake fucking is. Yeah. And um. But uh, yeah, John John had a bit of adversity. He was going for that shot, and he, and James he, was throwing that that kick at yeah. the same time. And I think then he got caught with the knee. Yeah. But still, the heart though, you know, yeah. he survived the onslaught, and um, yeah, reversed that takedown. He held onto that single leg, got that got that takedown, and then yeah, just started unleashing all the ground and pound. Yeah, and throwing hard elbows from the top and. Yeah, ref was like, fuck it, that's enough. Yeah. Seen enough. That was that was so quite like um Crawl James wasn't actually taking a lot of damage, but he was in a shit position because he wasn't gonna be able yeah. to escape. He right? wasn't defending himself too well. Like yeah. he already yeah. was, he was like those three minutes on the clock. Yeah. And he was already throwing hard elbows and a ton of punches. It's yeah. just like Yeah. Yeah, no, nah, he wasn't gonna escape that. Um yeah. Nah, yeah, John came yeah, back. Now, John, John fought go. recently as well. He fought in the Art of War. Yeah, Art of War. Yeah. That fight was crazy. Yeah. John was, John showed out in that fight. Yeah. Because um, uh, is his name John as well? Is it John Anderson? No. I don't remember the guy's I forget name. I his name. Did. Oh, fuck. Yeah. How can I forget his name? But that's it. But, um, yeah, that guy's a killer, bro. Yeah. That guy's not something to play with. And John showed out in that fight. And showed out here. Two yeah. divisions up. Showed out. Like, yeah, you can't sleep on John Vake, man. John Vake is that guy. And yeah. That's my docs. Let's go. Vake fan forever. And, uh, but yeah, nah, yeah, shout out to John, man. Wait, I zoned out for a second there. Shout out to John, man. Yeah, it like, he, I still, to this day, I feel like that JJ Ambrose fight, he beat him. Yeah, I still feel that yeah, way. Yeah, he beat JJ Ambrose, but it, it was, they knew it was probably JJ Ambrose's last fight, so they kind of were a little yeah. bit biased to us. Yeah. I don't know, I'm, I might be talking shit. Don't, yeah, you know? I, I could be biased myself, but fuck yeah. it, I am biased. Fuck yeah, it. yeah. You know what I mean? But uh, that's, that's my dog. Shout that's out to dogs. John. Shout out um, to John Bucket. Shout out to James. Um, yeah. yeah. Beautiful night. Beautiful fight from John Bucket. And uh, yeah, let's move on to... And next fight, what well, we had? We had Price. What's his name again? Uh, Nico Price? No, it's not Nico Price. <laughs> Who's Nico Price? Nico Price is in the UFC. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Sorry. I didn't mean to... Didn't mean to push. I, I wish I remember the name. We just wrote Price versus Cooper. What are the names? I can't... How do I get the name? That's all right. We can just go off the last name. Yeah. Yeah, we'll just go off the last name. Yeah. So, Price fought Cooper. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, round one KO by... Yeah, I think Price is their boxing coach for Shuriken, I think. Yeah. From what I heard. I think he is the, the boxing coach for Shuriken. Yeah, the striking coach. Yeah, the striking yeah, coach. Yeah. And, um, yeah, man, he came out. This is his last fight. He retired yeah. in the cage. Yeah. And he uh, was the first Shuriken fighter... First fighter to fight on Shuriken, the yeah. first Shuriken, Shuriken won, yeah, yeah, I think. Yeah. And first, is it bantamweight champion? I, do, I, I wish think I it was remember. like bantamweight. Yeah. I think it was bantamweight champion or light lightweight champion. Yeah. The first bantamweight or lightweight champion ever. Yeah. And yeah, been around the game for a long time. Put on some really good fights. Yeah. And what a fucking what a way to go out, man! Finished him, yeah. knocked him out. It was like an uppercut right hand, so it was yeah, like it was a almost from, like from, a from like, down yeah. right. Yeah. He kind of threw it. Like yeah. That. It was almost like an uppercut. Yeah. Right like hand, uppercut like, turned into a right hand. Yeah. Kind of yeah. almost yeah. Yeah. something like that. And yeah, got got the ground and pound. Yeah. And then and just caught him with another punch as well when he says he was going down. And yeah. It was done. That was a beautiful. That was a beautiful fight, man. It was beautiful good. performance yeah. from Price. And, and for him to win that way in his last fight is great, yeah. you know. It's, what it's a, a way to go out. Yeah, because I mean? most way? people, yeah, like, um, most people, right, when, when they know it's going to be the last fight, he said he didn't tell anyone, his family, his team, no yeah, one knew. Yeah. But most people, when they know it's going to be the last fight, they won't, in the back of their mind, it's like... I don't want to go out that way. Yeah, or it's like, fuck it, I'm, you know what I mean? Like, it, it's easier to just be like, right, I'm done with this shit. If they, they face a little bit of adversity. adversity yeah. yeah, he from the jump was like, fuck it, you know. Yeah. He, he got him. He got him good. Yeah. And, uh... Yeah. Yeah, beautiful fight from Price and um, you know, 
he keep, he um he said he, it's not a goodbye. A goodbye for now. Yeah, but, you know, like not not a goodbye. We'll see you later. Yeah, yeah. Kind of thing. So maybe he might come back in the future. Might might not. But for now, yeah, he's um he's hanging up the gloves. So good on him. Nah, and respect. Respect. Beautiful career. Well done. Yeah. Let's go. Next fight. Next fight. We got Zach Bennett for Khan Husmek. Yeah. And uh, yeah, Khan got a, got that dog in him. Yeah. It was it was, it was a tough fight. It was middleweight, right? I think it was middleweight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it was middleweight yeah. fight. And, um, Khan had really good defense. Yeah, take really down, good, the, take they down kept defense. rolling, reversing, yeah, right? Yeah, round one, that's right. But Zach Bennett was had really good shots. You yeah, know? really good uh, takedowns, like like shooting for takedowns. Yeah, and good striking for both guys as well. But man, the the ground game was was showed yeah. out on this one. Yeah, yeah. The the jiu-jitsu was different. The butterfly guards and just reversing positions and. And not giving positions easy, you know, and trying to yeah. move here and there. And, and but but Zach did a really good job in controlling. Yeah, controlling him on the bottom. But I still, uh, but still, got to give hats off to Khan's um, uh, defense, even yeah. against the cage, the defense, and even on the ground. You know what I mean? The way he was, was yeah. defending. Um, he sprawled. I remember that was one yeah, where he he's, shot and he sprawled so well. Uh, and yeah. picked him up immediately. It was it was yeah. clean, man. Khan had good. And Zach was like the. I guess he's like a, a popular guy. I don't know. He had a lot of promo from CSN, you know. Yeah, you know? I'm not sure what Jimmy's fighting. Out he's uh, Oliver MMA. All oh, right. Yeah, he's yeah. the same with um. Yeah, he, he had. A, it, I think it's his first pro debut. right? Pro debut, yeah. For yeah, both yeah. Of he them, had I a lot think. of hype coming into his pro debut. Yeah. Yeah. And um, yeah, he did. He did good, man. He had good yeah. strikes as well. He ended the fight on top. Yeah, like, he was like, on top. I don't know if he's ground and pounding, but he was like on top and controlling, yeah. landing some strikes. Yeah. You know, and and uh, still a good win for him. You know what I mean? And. And he was like twelve and zero in the amateurs, and now he's one and zero in, in yeah. uh, this thing. He's hey. been on. He's never lost. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> you know? good. good that's him, crazy. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, shout out to Zach Bennett. Yeah, and, and shout out to Khan as well, man. Yeah, They're, these guys are are good. And uh, yeah, not much to say there. You know, really, it was it was a it was yeah, it was a good, good fight. fight. Good yeah. fight. The good display of, of of wrestling sprawls and stuff. But uh, yeah, let's move on to. This was very controversial, but. Not really controversial. It was. The ending was pretty controversial, though. But I, I mean, it's not. To me, I don't think it's controversial. He he got caught with a punch. And he that, that made him, like, made him fuck his, his... Made him go off balance and fuck his leg up. Yeah. His foot up, so... I don't know. I don't remember it being like... I feel like he, see, it was the, he slipped on the mat. And then... No, he didn't slip, brother. He didn't slip. He got hit. And then... He got hit as he as he was moving. He he, he fucked his foot as he was moving. When he got hit, yeah, no, it was during the exchange though. It was during yeah, the during exchange. The exchange that left hook, that left hook. No, hit him. you see his leg slip backwards, and then he kind of stood. He stood up, and then he, when he put his leg back again, it slipped again. Like not slip, but he rolled his ankle yeah, or whatever. Rolled, yeah, so, yeah, but but because of the punches in the position he was standing, he was square. Yeah, and he was trying to move as he was square, and it. And he fucked his up. Yeah. Uh, by the way, we're talking about um. What's his Mayochi's full name? I think Kyle. Is it Kyle Mayochi? Yeah, because I think that his brother's Brandon, right, or something like that. No, um, I'm pretty sure it's Kyle. Mayo- yeah, Kyle Mayochi. Yeah. Yeah, and, Kyle Mayochi versus and Brody, Brad Ramsey and Brody Mayochi. Oh yeah. Yeah. Um, no, yeah, but regardless, right? Um, Mayochi was winning. Yeah. In my opinion. Yeah. He I had agree. a lot of good check hooks. Yeah, good check he, hooks. Yeah. Really. Really good feints, good um, good strikes, very yeah. good striking, good hands, man. He had really good boxing, yeah. And uh, Ramsey had good, uh, really good, uh, really good strikes too. Teeps you know? to the body, really I remember. good teeps. He yeah. had really good kicks as well. Yeah. Um, moving around, good movement, but but I think Miyoki was just uh, outlanding him a bit more. Yeah. On the feet, and um, yeah, until like uh, in the exchange, he rolled his ankle and then just yeah, yeah got hit, got started to get those punches laid on him and it was done. Yeah. And. Uh, yeah. Well, they said they'll run it back, so hopefully they run it back. Yeah, they can um, run it back at some yeah, point, but still yeah. a good win for Kyle. Good win, yeah. And um, they're from Australia, right? These yeah, guys were on, yeah. on the Relentless his, TV his show. His brother won the Relentless. Yeah. yeah. And he's just staying along, yeah. fighting at CKB. But uh, Brody, Brody's one to watch out for. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Oh, Brody is the guy. Yeah, yeah. that guy's that guy's yeah. scary. Brody's fucking good. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, shout out to Kyle, man. Let's shout go, Kyle. Kyle. Well done. Good job. Uh, This one. Um... What's Ali's full name? Ali Al is it Al Jasim? Ali Al Jasim for yeah. Prasant Gouda. Yeah, yeah. Bro. Ali <laughs> Ali is something else, man. Yeah, Ali was in the Matrix in this. This fight. motherfucker is something else. He really is um Yeah. He came out round one so clean, fainting, yeah. just standing there moving around. Switching stances yeah. so d- defensively so sound in both stances. Yeah. 
and just, confidence man, crazy as well yeah really good eyes really good eyes yeah. really good fucking counters yeah um good strikes just in the moment just in flow state man he's throwing yeah. knees like like he just knows like shot placements man all all the shots he was throwing beautiful placements like yeah Overall, really impressive striking, man. Like, yeah. this guy's impressive as fuck. I'm not going to lie. He's only been in CKB for a short time, but you can tell, like, how much he's leveled up as well using, you know, learning from, from our team. And yeah. Yeah, just him in general. Like, he's a good fighter, man. Really, really good fighter. Yeah. Fucking impressive. Um, yeah, so uh, I wrote some notes here on this one. So, round one, um, Ali came up. Oh, first thing, Ali's he's so good at con- controlling the fight. Yeah. He's never, like... He's never in exchanges where he, he might lose control, yeah. you know. Like like he was always in control throughout. His distance is yeah. so well. His kicks, his hands, he's throwing combinations, and he's he's so clean with yeah. everything, right? And then uh, I think yeah, at, towards the end of round one, Gura got the shot at the double and got the double. Yeah. But even from the bottom, like Ali's trying to throw triangles. Yeah. He's trying to get an armbar. Yeah, he's, he's not. He's not just uh, chilling out there. Yeah, but, yeah. Uh, yeah. I think Gura had like one or two uh, uh, shots, good shots. Yeah. But Ali just ate them. Was like, what? Well, let's go. Yeah. Nothing. You know what I mean? But um, yeah, it's just difficult. Uh, we know Prasan's a good fighter. Yeah. But um, yeah, you could just tell Ali like where the levels is different. Man. Ali yeah. is just way ahead of him in terms of like, just. Yeah, skill, I think. Yeah. Just skill and just confidence. Yeah, straight in, up. In himself, you know what I mean? And yeah, the guy just imposed him, man. Fuck. Yeah. He just, had, he just had all kinds of combinations, bro. Yeah. This guy. He threw flying knee in round two. Yeah. Like, he, he rocked um, Prasant bad yeah, in round plenty two. Of time, and, yeah. and, and Prasant shot again. He, yeah. That's that's one thing that Gouda is really good at. Because, you know, when, when I was fighting at Shuriken, um, the grassroots, um, Gouda was there. And Gouda, you know, funny enough, uh, Gouda was cornering one one of the guys that fought the other Ali Alistar from um, oh Van, Van Roon yeah, yeah. yeah he fought um, Gouda was in that guy's corner and they were warming up Gouda yeah. and the other guy was warming up with us and the one thing they were drilling the most was, was Jiu Jitsu and wrestling yeah. and you see because that's uh, you can tell that's Gouda's main thing as well yeah. like Jiu Jitsu and wrestling because every time he got he got shot on Ali for the most part he got Ali down yeah and uh yeah, he managed to survive round two with the, those flying knees and those strikes, and yeah. he survived that. But man, round three, that finish, yeah, that yeah. was the cleanest three-two I think anyone landed throughout yeah. the whole fight card. It's just clean. He just stood from far away, boom, boom, yeah. right on the side of Buddha's yeah. head, bro. That and that, he was kind of rock. Fucking, that was hard, boom, bro. He fell Holy down. Shit, that was a hard three-two right there. Yeah, he and finished him clean, perfectly landed, yeah. perfectly timed. Yeah, and then yeah, just. Prasan was done at that point, to be honest. His yeah. eyes wasn't there. He wasn't there. Yeah, he was. He was. He was yeah, he almost. Like, if he landed a knee, I think he would have been out. He went. He for needs the, to the body. Yeah, yeah. No, he was going for the head, but because yeah. because Prasan ducked and he was going because remember he was like this. Yeah, and yeah, he, yeah. he ducked, ducked down here. Yeah, yeah. He was going for that knee, and I think he came back up a little bit as yeah. the knee was coming, and then yeah, fuck, that was scary. He fell after the knee though. Yeah, the knee he, hit his body. Yeah, yeah. Like, he fell and then oh man yeah so we have fucking beautiful performance from Ali man well yeah. done good fight fucking yeah. good fight dominated uh, next fight we had Rory O'Keefe O'Keefe O'Keefe, O'Keefe I think it's O'Keefe, O'Keefe right yeah Rory 24-7 O'Keefe fought Keone Terror Rotua yeah Keone yeah fuck, Keone bro. beat the shit out of him man like Keone fuck. just like we strike. know like look we know how good Rory is yeah Rory, Rory is good fucking good yeah like super XFC, good XFC uh, amateur champion yeah Shuriken uh, uh, Bantamweight champion I think well. so as yeah, well. he yeah he is yeah yeah, yeah. oh nah, and then he lost to Prasan Prasan beat him remember he got the armbar on him yeah no I think yeah. when they and, fought, then, and, then, and then he got the belt again I think yeah he won, he, he I think belt. he won the belt after he won the belt after when he fought that other guy. You know the guy that gas for days. Yeah, 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 yeah. He fought on this guy as well. We'll talk yeah. about him later. I forget his name now. But yeah, but Prasant Gouda beat Rory before. Yeah, yeah. But and he got the belt. Prasant got the belt. Prasant got the belt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And then um, yeah, later on. But, um, but uh, yeah, so we know how good Rory is. But Keone, bro, Keone is an OG at City Kick Boxing. He's been yeah. he's been at the gym for a long, long time. Yeah. And um, finally, he got, he, you know, he got his chance to show out over here. Yeah. Fuck, he, he was so smart, man. He's yeah. switching stances, just touching his hand, touching yeah. his hand, moving just around. Just giving him all the different Shock, looks. Bang, immediately All got the it. different looks, you yeah. know what I mean? Southpaw, he's just giving, he can switch. He, he can yeah. fight on both stances. He'll go orthodox, show him some looks. Um, yeah, man, and then just set up. He was... Fuck, bro. It's, when, I'm, what, when I'm thinking back, it's just like the way he was... 
making the reads, you know what I mean? Making yeah. the reads that he needed and then backed him up, boom. Perfect timing, got that shot. Yeah. Took him down. Was throwing some heavy ground and pound. Um then yeah, and then that like it was it was so smart like how he was pulling the arm. Yeah, oh, the arm fuck man. Rory like if you watch the fight back, Rory's yeah. arm shouldn't have bent that way, yeah. man. Like that his, was like all the way out like fuck. His bro. hand yeah. was over oh, his hand was on uh, this shoulder. Yeah, it was on the other side of the shoulder. Like, yeah, fuck, like bro, it was on crazy. his opposite shoulder blade yeah. at the back. Like yeah. Fuck, that like, was fucked, bro. Hey, but, you but, can tell he was wincing in yeah, pain. Like, yeah. he was but, twisting that But you can tell Keone was so smart, bro. Like, he was pulling the arm there. Yeah. He knew he wanted to trap that to take the arm away and yeah. then put his weight on him. And, yeah, man, like, that's he, some high-level IQ shit, yeah. bro. He and, immediately went for that arm. Yeah, As soon as Rory's arm yeah. went down, he immediately, like, got yeah. it there, man. Like, he knew what he wanted to do immediately. Really fucking super technical, super high-level IQ. Yeah. And then when he, when he got that choke in... When he sank that choke and he was choking uh, Rory out. Yeah, Rory's, Rory's arm, arm was stuck. You could st- tell yeah. he wanted to tap. Yeah. And the thing was, the Keone is when he got the... It's just... Fuck, man. When I'm watching him, he already had his hooks in and he elevated his, his legs up. Yeah. So he can't move anywhere. Yeah. So while he got that choke in, now his legs are in the air. So he can't... He can't... He can't move his hips. Yeah. Nothing. Yeah, yeah. You know, so he's already elevated... And his arm is stuck underneath him, and he got that choke. He couldn't tap. He couldn't tap. You could you tell. Could tell. Like, he was like, trying so Rory hard. Rory was shaking and trying yeah. to tap. As soon as his arm was free, Rory Bro, immediately tapped. Tap. Immediately, yeah. That would have been a scary Bro, thing that, to feel. That was. That must be a fucking scary position to yeah. be in. Because you 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 don't, don't want to go out. Cause yeah. The, if anyone's never been choked out, right? When you yeah. get when you get caught in a, in a choke. A lot of people are like, oh, just go to sleep, man. You feel like you're going to die. Yeah. Like, it, you don't feel like, oh, let me just go to sleep. Yo, your, heart like rate, your heart rate is already high as fuck. Your, your body's wanting uh, oxygen. Yeah, yeah, oxygen and blood to flow as yeah. well. And your shoulder is fucking killing you yeah. and you're getting choked out. That's crazy, bro. Yeah, fuck, man. That was, but, that was um, a brutal way for yeah. That was Rory's debut, pro debut yeah. as well. That's, that's tough, man. Yeah, tough. but Keone, bro, fuck, bro. What an animal. What a beast. Yeah. He's fucking assassin, bro. Yeah. Yeah, straight savage. So shout out to Keone. Shout out to Keone, man. What a fucking beautiful win, bro. What Monster. a gangster. Yeah. He's a straight All gangster. All respect after the fight as well. You yeah. Know, man. Beautiful um, respect. Beautiful yeah. show of respect as well from Keone. But yeah. yeah. I'm looking forward to see Keone fight more, man. I need to yeah. see. We need to see him more. Yeah. Yeah. Now you know if they didn't know who he is, now who he know. was before. Now you know. Now yeah. you know who he is. So, yeah. And shout out to Rory as well, man. Yeah. That's, and shout out to Rory. Keep your head up, man. Yeah. Keep working and come back again. You know yeah. what I mean? Tough, tough yeah. way to debut, you know. But yeah. Hey, yeah it but is this is the game. Is. This is yeah. the game we play. You know, wins and losses, ups and downs. But yeah. you just keep, you know, keep keep working and keep coming back again. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's the main card for Shuriken Fight Series, yeah. and now we'll go into the prelims. It was headlined by Jack Cameron versus Jack Ball. Oh, yeah, yeah. Apparently, these guys didn't like each other. Yeah, I don't know. That's that's them, what yeah. they said on the, on the commentary. There's yeah. a lot of bad blood between them. So, I don't think they touched gloves or anything yeah. like that. Um, yeah, I, I know round one, I can't remember exactly what happened, but I know round one that um, Jack got a takedown, right? And I think he was... Let me read the notes. Um... Oh yeah, Jack, Jack, oh I said Jack, both of them were Jacks. Yeah. <laughs> so, so you're Cameron or yeah. Ball. Cameron got the takedown and got, almost got Jack Ball in a, yeah, in a rear naked. Cameron had really good striking, man. Yeah, he oh, him Cameron, yeah, he's he's on point yeah. with striking. But, um, now yeah, it's a good fight. I can't, I, 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 have, my, my, I have very vague memory of yeah, this fight. because there were so many fights. Yeah, but I remember I know, the I finishing know. sequence. Yeah. He was smashing balls face. Yeah. No. That's that's crazy. Yeah, he was dominating ball, man. Yeah. That was a fucking crazy he fight. Was, he was on top, man. Yeah. Like, if you go look at the CSN's... Because uh, when you watch the CSN live stream versus the CSN, like, iPhone footage yeah. that they post on Instagram, the Instagram will look brutal as fuck. Yeah. Like, you can see that's why the referee stopped it because, yeah. man, Jack Cameron was on top. Yeah, he was just He was goal. smashing was vicious, his bro. face in, man. Bang, that shit was bang, vicious. Bang, bang, vicious bang, bang. Vicious pound. Yeah, Jack Cameron really is... He got a lot of support as yeah. well. I feel like Jack Cameron and Rory, every time they fight on the, on the Shuriken the whole, Cup, the whole arena half, goes crazy, yeah. man. They got a lot of support. A lot Facts. of friends, a lot of just people, fans maybe as well. Yeah. And, you know, like... Facts. Yeah, but, Jack's um, fighting out of um, yeah. Extreme MMA, I think, in Pukiko. That was, that was yeah, some bad blood right there. Yeah, that was some... That white, was a bad white ending. White to crime. <laughs> 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 nah, it was it was um it was good, man. Shout out to Jack Ball yeah. as well. Jack Ball fought someone. Yeah, I, he I fought Rika Karyopa, I think. I think I remember. Yeah. I remember seeing Jack Ball as well. Like I remember yeah. him. Uh, he, he's a good fighter as well. But 
Yeah, wait. really good. She, these, they, the, I, I remember a little bit uh, vaguely remember, but the the striking exchanges they had, like the feints and the yeah. looks and everything from Jack Ball was nice. Yeah. But Cameron is just smart, man. He he's good with the takedowns. He's he's good with the jiu-jitsu stuff as yeah. well. And uh, nah, I'm, I'm I'm really I'm a fan of Jack Cameron. That's yeah. for sure. Yeah, 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 definitely. I remember his fight. So yeah, yeah I, I can't wait to see what he's got next. Yeah, I can't wait to see his next fight. So yeah, good on you, Jack Cameron. Well Jack done. Jack Cameron, shut up. Now, this is the one fight oh. I was the most excited oh, for. Yeah. I was fucking amped. I didn't care about any other fight. I know a lot of guys from our gym, yeah. CKB, but one fight I wanted to watch. Ethan Brockett versus Caden Skipper. Fucking k Dogs, G. So Snatcher! Bro, what do you know about the Soul Snatcher? He Unfortunately, was... didn't win. Yeah, but fuck, k Dogs was, was a gangster, bro. That guy's All the way through. Dude. He is cold. Like I'm a fan yeah. through and through, bro. This guy is fucking awesome, bro. bro. Pe- people don't know who K-Dox is, but fuck. Yeah. That night they knew who K-Dox is, bro. K-Dox mm. a fucking gangster. Yeah. Um. Personally, I feel I felt like K-Dox had two to one. Yeah. It, it, it's a very it, close. Fight, it was super though. close, but yeah. I still feel like K-Dox had two I, to one. I feel K-Dox, K Kaden won as well. Yeah. Kaden had two to one, but um. Yeah, like fuck, man. Kados came out. Kados is just striking. is crazy. Just a right? walkout. Yeah, yeah. He's just confident. He knows. He knows who he is. He knows yeah. he's him. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. And yeah, came out fucking ready to go, bro. He just put yeah. it on him. Came that, out swinging. Bop, bop, bop. He shot, three twos, bro. uppercuts, hooks, just those kicks, solid the striking. Eights, those yeah. head kicks. He landed that fucking head kick, bro. Yeah. It's crazy, bro. Caden is is yeah. yeah, but also I want to I have to give a shout out to Ethan. Plum. Yeah, yeah. First of all, he's a very enter- entertaining guy. I always said like I like his personality. I feel like the 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 fight scene needs personalities like this, like yeah. like you know like like charismatic, funny fo- characters. So it's it's good to see him, you know. And he came up with the whole yeah. Matador mask or whatever the fuck is that that yeah. Lucha Libre mask. Yeah, he's cool. He's cool. He's a, he's a bit annoying at times, but he's a cool. He's a cool dude. Yeah. And uh, for him to stand there and eat all those yeah. strikes from Caden. That guy's, that guy's a in dog. The small Ethan's gloves. a dog, though. Yeah, Ethan's a dog. He got he, a chin on him as well. He didn't even look like he was hurt ever. Like, he just was eating punches and covering up, but it didn't yeah. look like he was getting hurt bad, yeah. like rock, wobble, nothing. You yeah. know, he was eating. Think about what Caden did to everyone with the big gloves, right? Yeah. He, Caden finished that. Um, uh, they weren't big gloves, they're all small gloves. No, with uh, Lamanu. He oh, kneed yeah, him yeah, in the yeah, face. Was, Obviously, yeah, the yeah. knee was it, but then the three-two rocked yeah. him first, right, with the yeah. big gloves. Like Caden fucked him up with yeah. big gloves, you know. And then even with the small gloves, with the other guy, um, uh, Shane, Shane um, Willis, or uh, Shane, Shane the Ship. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Shane. Even with that, you know, three-two, uh, low fall, three, and then um, uh, he was done. Yeah, uh-huh. he was done from there, yeah. right? And he did sort of the same thing. The the boom threes to to Ethan, yeah. and Ethan ate those. Like yeah. it's crazy. Like Ethan got a chin for sure. Yeah. And that's how he survived. Yeah. He survived obviously by shooting and, and stalling yeah. the fight, which is a, it's as a fan, it's fucking annoying to yeah. watch, right? Like shout out to Ethan, he won, congrats. Yeah. But as a fan, it's it's frustrating when when guys stall. It's like the same Devin Aney and Ryan Garcia shit. Yeah. You know, when Garcia's landing those punches, Devin's hugging him and yeah, holding yeah, yeah, him, yeah. you know. It's, it's the same shit with Ethan. Yeah. But well, Ethan, did, Ethan, Ethan did, did 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 what he needed to do in the third he round. Did, he, I mean. And that's the thing, shout out to him. He finds a way to win. Yeah. Every time, even with Diddy, Diddy it, if he st- stood in strike with Diddy, Diddy would have <laughs> fucked him up bad, bro. Yeah. Diddy would have beaten the shit out of him, but he knew he had to shoot. He yeah. shot, he got it, and he secured it. Yeah. It, with Kaden, the same thing. The only reason he won is because yeah. he, he But shot. man, the way uh, uh, um, K-Dogs did that reversal in that second round, fuck, that was so gangster. Was, was it the second or first? I think it was the second, maybe. Yeah. I second, think it, was, it, was, it was just on the cage. First, I they, I don't think, I'm pretty sure second round, they didn't go to the ground. It was just they held each other against the yeah. fence. I know. Second round, K Dog reversed and held him against the cage. Yeah, yeah. The first, first yeah. round, is first like round, a, yeah, yeah, where he did that reversal. He, that yeah, was fucking he, yeah. cool. He he did that knee slide and just came through. Yeah. Fuck, that was gangster. But um, Ethan Ethan did a good job just controlling him against the cage. You know what I mean? And then yeah. um, in the third round, just yeah, just yeah. Just so so that him. that we have to give that. Yeah, hundred percent. Like third round, way, fair yeah. and square. Ethan fully won that round. Yeah, clearly won that yeah. round. Um, and then. I, I personally feel round one around to Caden. Yeah. You know, uh, but but the judges saw it. But still, it's, it's not over, you know, we're going to run that shit back. Yeah. We're it's, run it it back. was a split decision. So one judge saw it for Caden, yeah. anyways, you know, and then other two gave it to, yeah. uh, to Ethan. But, and, but, but, and but also, shout out to Ethan. Well done. Yeah. Well shout done. out to Ethan. Sorry if we're coming across as uh, as biased. Yeah. But, but that's Kaden, my dog. Caden's <laughs> our guy. That's my fucking dog, bro. Caden's our guy. So, so it's, it's yeah. hard. It's hard. We're trying to be as neutral as we can. Yeah. 
But it's hot. It's hot. Yeah, no, Kaden's our guy. My dog. But yeah. shout out to Ethan. I have to get. I still have to give him his props because yeah. I can't just be a dickhead and just. You know, he's a champion. Now. Yeah. I don't know what weight class though. Yeah, he, he's won the belt. Uh, Some weight class. Seventy kgs, I think. I yeah. think it's like lightweight or something. Yeah. I, can't, I don't know what belt that was. Don't know, but but um, amateur belt. So yeah, yeah shout out to Ethan Brock. You know, I mean, this. You know, I can't wait to see what his story is next. Yeah. But for K Dox, it ain't over. It's just a little bump. Yeah, it is. we're gonna run back. We're gonna snatch that soul, and uh, yeah. hopefully we can run this shit back one more time. We yeah. can run that, run this fight back one more time, and he can hopefully get that job done. Yeah. But shout out to Ethan Brockett, good shout fight. Shout out to Ethan, good and fight. And shout out to K Dogs, man. We're gonna run that shit back. Let's get it. Straight up. Uh, let's move on. We from from Caden and and and, and <laughs> from Caden and Ethan, we had the. Uh, the inaugural sumo wrestling comp. No, 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 no. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Okay, okay. No, 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 no. Please, please. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. But no, we had um, Matteo Smith fought Leo La 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 Leo. La Leo, yeah. yeah. Leo La Leo and yeah. um, uh, man, these guys had a. Uh, Who won? I think it was Matteo. Leo, Leo, Leo won. won. Yeah, yeah Matteo was yeah. the one that was that was yeah, getting, yeah. that was getting beat. But they they thugged it out, man. They thugged it out to yeah. the end. Yeah, like fuck. They 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 had a lot of clinching, but yeah, it, but, I feel like but they, Matthew they, Matthew shot for like sh- like tried to wrestle and yeah, like, yeah. for takedowns. I think they got some takedowns. Yeah, too, right? but Leo yeah. was dominating. Dominating. Yeah, like, he was Leo, on top. He yeah. was like on top, hugging him and yeah. And Leo Leo had a lot of good output, good strikes. Yeah, like a lot of punches. Leo but, hurt him bad yeah. a lot of times, but then yeah. Matthew would clinch. And that's the thing, right? These fights they had a lot of clinching, yeah. which stalled a lot of it. But nah, Leo got that dog, man. Yeah. He called out a bunch of heavyweights. Yeah. I forget what he said. In the yeah, 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 yeah. He said anyone, he'll fight anyone. Yeah, yeah, like that. Yeah. And but but Matthew as well. Shout out to Matthew for staying in it. Yeah, you know what yeah. I mean? Like taking all that damage and still like yeah. still being in it and, and not giving up. So yeah, that was a good fight. It yeah. was a good fight. Good back and forth. And um, yeah, shout out to Leo, man. Shout out to Hopefully Leo. you can see one more, uh, see him more in the future. Yeah. See what he's got next. What's next for him? Well, that was yeah, good fight. Great fight. And uh, sorry, yeah, apologies if all the joke earlier, but um, no, no, can't uh, run it back now. You gotta run it with Leo. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Next fuck fight, that. you see Leo running with him. No, nah, fuck <laughs> that. I'll run away, brother. <laughs> um, nah. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, let's go to the next fight. Um, our guy Tama yeah. Hikili fought Ooh, Sukman Athwa. My dog. My dog, Tama Hikili got that dog in him, bro. Yeah. He got that fucking he, dog. Um, shout out to Sukman. He's yeah, this on, on a week's notice. On a week's notice, yeah. yeah. And, and, and I'd give give Sukman his props. Yeah, because you know I mean? on a week's notice. Yeah, he he almost beat Tama, let's yeah. be honest. You know yeah. what I mean? Like, like yeah, he, he had him hurt. Yeah. He had him hurt. His, he, had, he has a lot of power in his hands, man. Crazy power. Oh, yeah. those right hands were like heavy. You can yeah. tell like whenever he, uh, Tama got hit, it was like, oh shit. Yeah. You know, but um, uh, round one, like, like it was good, you know, um, Good, good fight from Tama. Good jabs, yeah. distance, movement, and all that. But man, yeah. there was that one moment when Tama was backing yeah. up. Backing up as he's backing up, like I think he he slipped against the cage. Yeah. And he tried to hold himself up, and boom, he got yeah. caught with that right. right. It was like a right hand, but like a yeah. right hook. Almost like a hook. Yeah. There. And, and um, yeah, Sukman was doing good. You know, just like throwing those punches and yeah. trying to get in. And then um, yeah. yeah, he got he got that right hook through, and, 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 and he and dropped. He dropped like, Tama. The Tama way went. the way Tama fell, it yeah. looked like it was hurt clean. Yeah. I was like, oh, and he's so far. Yeah, it was like, like Tama, no. Tama. 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 Did not give up. Tama got onto that, that leg. Immediately, yeah. he's like gone to that leg. Yeah, and Sukma was letting go, bro. He was not. He was trying to get him out of there. Yeah, but the Tama, ref, yeah, the ref was watching. Yeah. The ref was looking. The ref was, the ref was looking. Tama was holding. Tama was like, no, 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 good. I'm good. I'm good. Yeah, and yeah, and then got that takedown. Yeah. Ooh, what's that? Okay, um, mosquito. But yeah, and got that takedown. So Tama, fuck man, Tama's a dog for yeah. that. Tama's a fucking dog. Then he came back, and um, I have very hazy memory yeah, of this hazy fight. Memory but well, but it yeah. was I, I know I know that that Tama was getting caught a yeah, lot. Yeah, he had a cut on his eye. Yeah, like like. And then, I think was I think landing the, the jabs yeah. and right hands. And I think it was the third round where. The leg kick started to hurt. Yeah. And, and Sukma started to get tired in that third round. Yeah. He started to guess. Obviously, when he had a week's notice. Yeah. But um, I think Tama didn't realize how bad the leg was the hurt. The leg was hurt, yeah. Yeah, because Sukma, like, like, he switched he up to switch stance. Yeah. yeah. But I, I reckon another three, two, two more leg kicks. Two, yeah. three more leg kicks. He would have been down. down. He yeah. would have been down. Um, so, but yeah. either way, either way, he, he, he caught... Ooh, this fucking mosquito is so annoying. Yeah. But um, how did he... Oh, he landed a 3-2. 
Yeah, yeah. Three, two, and then and uh, Sukma started covering up yeah, right yeah. at the end. Yeah, when almost. that hook landed, that hook landed, it, it, it hurt him. Yeah, and then Tama just started to unleash that. Yeah, you know, the punches and knee to the it. body, and then he yeah. dropped him and finished him. With like with like four or five seconds left, you know. Yeah, like right at the end. Yeah, you know? that was a fucking beautiful fight, man. Like yeah, beautiful fight from both guys. But Tama, man, Tama got yeah. that dog. You know, he got that hot. Those was Tama's first no shins and small gloves. Small, and yeah. also that that was probably one of the things why Tama was yeah, it like, made a big difference yeah. as well. And and Tama was getting hurt a lot. As as well as yeah. because he fought with bigger gloves so he probably yeah. was a jab wouldn't have hurt him the way it did now yeah you know like eating a jab before was yeah, right. eating i think a those jab. are like seven or eight ounce gloves yeah usually. yeah um and now it's yeah, four four ounce, you know it, four ounce is like a brick bro. yeah it's like a brick so yeah i feel like that that um yeah he wasn't used to he wasn't used to it so now that, that he's felt that he can change he can add yeah. more head movement or some yeah. shit he can change his game a little bit yeah. more you know at least now he knows what what it feels like you yeah know, get hit yeah and those are like fuck you can't play around these small yeah gloves. straight up and not only the small girl also the power that that Superman has as well. yeah. he got some fucking heavy hands he was a thick guy as well yeah so but yeah sh- uh, shout out to Superman. you know props to him for taking the fight on a week's notice but yeah. man Tama let's go dog that's my Round dog right there and, yeah what a fucking dog bro this is the Tama's hardest fight. He's always Hard. finished everyone in the round one. Yeah. Round one, round and two. He's only going to level up from here. These yeah. kind of fights is what makes you level up. So you yeah. see the next time he fights, he's going to be on a whole different level. Straight up. 100%. Yeah. So yeah. Shout out to Tama. Let's Shout go. Shout out to Tama. Guy, and uh, Gene Jeremick fought Nick Lowe. Nick Lowe. Uh, Nick Lowe, man. This is the guy with the white hair, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah Holy yeah, yeah. fuck. His striking is hey, he's fucking on. good. He's, he's on. southpaw as well. Those I think he switches. He switches stances. He, I think so. I yeah, he went orthodox yet. and he throws one two from orthodox. But I think he's mainly a southpaw. Yeah. Those body kicks was crazy. Every single time he blasted those body kicks, it landed. Every single yeah. one. Not one miss. Not one was checked. Not one miss. Yeah. Like he's so fast, bro. Yeah. Really good fucking striking. He was just piecing. He was piecing Gene up. Yeah. I can't remember which round. How did how did Gene beat him? I don't remember now. I know Gene beat him. Um, maybe. Oh I no, was some takedown. I think he started taking him down. Did he win by decision? I can't remember now. I wish, yeah. I, I should have written down in the notes. I, I just I wrote that Gene beat him. And um, Gene Jeremick is the guy that Jack Cameron fought last. Yeah. Yeah. Bro, Gene Jeremick is a machine. That guy yeah. had cardio for cardio days. Cardio for that days, fight? yeah. Fuck, bro. Ah, Gene's fuck. bald now. You look a little bit like... Um, what's that guy again in the UFC? Rafael Fiziev when Rafael, Rafael went bald. He kind of looked the same. I was like, damn. Yeah, I, I, it's not showing how Gene won. Yeah. Apologies to Gene. Yeah, I, I, I can't. We had so many fights. I think to get it would have been decision. I think he 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 wrestled him. Yeah, yeah. I don't I don't remember because um yeah. yeah I I wish I, I he started I, to shut he shot started to shut his um, striking down. Yeah. And um yeah he got the dub but um but I'm impressed by by Nick Lowe as well. I really want to see him fight again. Yeah. Um I don't know what card whatever card but I'll, I'll definitely that's the name I'll definitely um remember. And Gene Jeremy, we already remember from the last fight. Yeah, from, from the, the fight we had with Rory. Rory, yeah, That was yeah. a crazy back and forth fight. That was a gangster fight. Gene had cardio for days. Oh, yeah. Bro. He fought Rory. My bad. I said Jack Cameron. Sorry, yeah. sorry. Rory. Yeah, he yeah. fought Rory. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That yeah. fight was crazy. Like, first of all, the arena... Oh, okay, we can't talk about that fight. We already did. But that yeah. arena when G, when Gene fought um, Rory, Rory was fucking crazy. Yeah, that, that was a crazy yeah, fight. Yeah, because, man, Gene was crazy. Gene's fucking yeah. a machine, bro. Yeah. This guy's like Marab. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's like up. fucking Marab. He got bro. gas for days. This is Marab yeah. of fucking... This is the Marab in Auckland, bro. <laughs> yeah. This is Gene Jeremy. But yeah, good fight by Gene. Well done. Got the dub. So, come on to see what's next for him. Yeah. And who we got next? We got Iban Malay versus Trent Turner. Oh, yeah. yeah. Trent. Let's go, bro. Trent. Yeah. Trent's Trent, a fucking giant, by yeah, the way. He's, he looked, tall as fuck. He probably looked like, um, like a small... He looked like Mike Tyson. Uh, yeah. In three, yeah. Um, but no, yeah, I, I know Trent came up, feints was good. You yeah. know, it was just, he was moving around very well. Um, he was landing a lot of kicks. Um, low kicks, I think it was like... like I'm pretty sure it was his lead leg. Is he yeah. uh, sorry? Is um is Trent Salpo or Orthodox? I can't remember. He switches, right? Yeah, I think he switches. Yeah. But I think he's mainly Orthodox. Um, yeah. Uh, yeah, I think I think it was it the first round. I think Trent going down. He tried to get the armbar, but he couldn't get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so it was it was good. Like you know, moving around. Iban was I think landed some heavy punches in the first round. He hurt Trent a little bit. Yeah. I think, 
And um, but yeah, Trent. Was, yeah, yeah, yeah. Iban did that. I remember, and then Trent immediately clinched, right? He yeah, clinched, yeah, yeah. I don't know if he got him down. Yeah. Did he get him down? I think he. I think, I he, think he got him down. down yeah, there, but yeah. he got rocked. Right? Yeah, he got yeah, rocked that's with right. That one. Yeah, 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 yeah. He got rocked with that. Um, but but it stayed there, it stayed in there, you know what yeah. I mean? And and, and and clinched up. Yeah. Took him down, and was controlling position on the ground, and tried to get the amba, but didn't get in that first round. And then second round. You know, made the adjustments, came back, looked sharp immediately. Where as soon as he mounted him, right? Yeah. As soon as he mounted, yeah. Boom, and and it was a good shot as well. Like he, yeah. I think he shot for the takedown, very yeah. good, very clean shot. Took him down, got that mount immediately, and then yeah. boom, that was it. Submitted him right there. Yeah, that was a fucking beautiful fight from, um, uh, from Trent. Trent, 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 Turner. Trent did a did a fucking good work. Yeah. So um, yeah, can't wait to see Trent fight again. And, and um, I can't remember what, what weight class is this. Is lightweight? Is it? Oh, hey, uh, I can't remember. No way is lightweight. These nah, guys nah, are nah. huge. Probably like welterweight or middleweight. Yeah, they were like at least middleweight or light heavyweight. They were yeah. big. Dudes. No, I don't think light heavy. They I were think it was big. like welterweight maybe. They were big though. These guys so? were big. Yeah. Trent maybe. was fucking huge and uh, Iban yeah. was jacked as fuck. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, shout out to Trent, man. Yeah. Fucking good fight. Let's go, baby. Uh, next fight, we have um, Rika Kereopa fought Sean Burma. Uh, this is where um, Rika got his um, Dustin Poirier moment. Yeah, he, <laughs> he, jumped, he jumped, jumped the gilly. gilly. I was like, jump the gilly! Yeah. <laughs> jump the gilly! That's crazy. Rika, in his last fight, right? He um, In the last fight, in round three, he turned into Khabib. All of a sudden, he started, <laughs> yeah. he started he taking... He started wrestling crazy. Yeah, he started bro. wrestling crazy. Yeah. yeah. And now, that. this fight, he turned into fucking yeah, I Dustin I love this Poirier. guy, bro. This guy's fucking entertaining. I love yeah. it. And he always comes out with the, with the UFC shorts. Yeah, the same red yeah. ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. His jab is beautiful. I've been saying it since the first time I watched watched him fight I was like bro he has such a beautiful jab yeah. and even today when we were watching even commentators were saying that jab is beautiful he has yeah. such a beautiful jab man. I like the way he throws his jab yeah. Rika's jab is beautiful yeah um, so I just wrote a but I think notes, Sean but yeah um, Rika has got good striking that's yeah. for sure the feints the way he yeah. moves he circles around um, yeah I think I think Sean wrestled quite a bit let me just read yeah. the notes real quick um, I think Sean Sean took him down yeah, yeah, so uh, so yeah, Sean eventually got got the oh yeah. yeah yeah Sean got the single leg and took Rika yeah, down. Yeah. That's right. Yeah, he sh- that was a good shot as yeah. well. Yeah, but then Rika was managed to reverse yeah. that and um, but not yeah. But um, but Rika had really good defense, really good um, stability against the, along the cage as well. Yeah 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 yeah. He's hard to take down. Yeah, but um, eventually I think he got him down. He jumped the gilly and got it. Like it, first of all, getting a guillotine right is hard. Yeah. In MMA. Everybody knows how to defend yeah. a guillotine, you know. But Rika's gilly was tight. He was waiting. He, he was he was like trying to cinch that arm in. Yeah. And once he got it locked in, he was like, sweet, I got it. Yeah. And then he jumped it. I was like, Dustin Poirier! Yeah. yeah. Jump the gilly! <laughs> and yeah, that, was, that shit was fucking tight, bro. And then, yeah. yeah. Got, got that the jab, yeah. But shout out to Rika, man. Shout out guy, Rika. This, this guy, I, I like this guy. Yeah. I, like this yeah. Guy. I want to see him fight more. Fighting out of Rotorua, yeah. I think. Yeah. Yeah. So shout out to Rika, got that dub. And, yeah. and shout out to Sean as well. Good, shout good, to Sean. good fight from both guys. Yeah. Um, but yeah, well done, Rika. Let's go. Yeah. On to the next. Nixon Sutton's. My dog, Let's go. bro. It's my fucking dog, bro. Nixon fought Jaden O'Day. O'Day? But yeah. man, Nixon bro. dominated Jaden. This, this kid is the future of MMA. Like, yeah. he's a future champion. You can already see it from here. Yeah. He's only 17 years old. Bro, 10 8 rounds, brother. All three, yeah. 10 8 rounds. Not a single Domination, round. Jaden, Jaden, yeah. Jaden. On the feet and on the ground, both. Yeah. Jaden was not Jaden. Sorry, Nixon was violating Jaden. Yeah. I mean, respect to Jaden, but I gotta say it. Yeah, bro, like fuck, he just fucking he ragged just on him. He beat the shit out of him. He ragged on him and beat yeah. the shit out of him, bro. And it was light work. Like, like uh, uh, in round three, uh, when round two ended, right in between yeah. round two and three, Jaden is gassed out, breathing yeah. heavy. Nixon's oh. standing there chilling. Yeah, this, this is another day for Nixon. This is like Nixon inspiring. Yeah, this is another day inspiring. Nick, Nixon was just lifting him up oh, and throwing him down. Bro, bro he got one, that right? fucking suplex, suplex, dog. He picked him up twice bro. and slammed him, and then a fucking suplex, bro. bro. When Nixon did the suplex, I lost my mind. I was like, yeah. this motherfucker got him with the suplex. That's just crazy, man. Bro, Nixon just showed He levels. beat him like how Khalil Round 3 beats people. Yeah. This motherfucker was soccer kicking him and shit. Yeah, fuck, man. <laughs> I was laughing at that shit. I was like, he just soccer kicked him. But yeah, the pure, pure domination. Pure domination by yeah. Nixon. Um, I don't see anyone beating Nixon. I don't see anyone beating Nixon. Yeah. He called for that uh, bantamweight belt, right? Yeah, the bantamweight belt. So many guys going for the bantamweight belt. Who, who's in that, that division? I know Gene Jeremy. Yeah. Uh, who else? 
Jean I Jeremy, think... Prasant Gouda. Oh no, Prasant Gouda is pro now. No, but uh, Ali. Ali called for the belt. But he's probably calling for the pro belt, right? Oh, yeah, true. Is there a pro shuriken belt? I don't think so. I think no, they only no, got no, amateur no. belts. Oh, no. I don't think Ali called for the belt. That's my bad. Yeah. Who else called for it? Did Tama call for the belt? No. Yeah, Tama called yeah, for the Tama belt. Yeah, Tama called for the belt. Yeah, 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 Tama called for the belt. So yeah. it's like Tama, Nixon, and Gina yeah. that are going for it. Yeah, right? but I think Nixon only had one MMA fight. Yeah. Right? So I think he still might be a bit... It'll before probably be... Because it might be one of these guys. Tama here. versus Gene for the belt, probably. Yeah, yeah, probably. Because it's now he had more MMA yeah. fights, you know. It's now vacant. It's not vacant, but now it's like available, right? Yeah. Because cause, um, Rory is He's now... pro, yeah. Pro, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, Gene, um, but Gene yeah, versus... But Nixon, Nixon's the future, man. Nixon yeah. is the fucking future. His, That's his kickboxing fight as well. Before that, he beat the fuck out of that yeah. guy. Like, fully beat the like, shit out of that guy. Like, I don't think there's anyone that's on the level of his wrestling and yeah, jiu-jitsu. No right? way, no way. And, and, yeah. yeah, no one. Yeah. I don't think anyone can touch him there. And striking-wise, he's fucking good. Yeah. But... On the ground, there's just no one that can touch you. Yeah, straight you know up. What I mean? Yeah. So, and Nixon, uh, that's my guy, man. I love Shout Nixon. Shout out to Nixon, bro. Ninja yeah. Nixon. Um, yeah. Hey, Pure domination. Violated up. my man. Yeah. He violated him. Yeah. Beat the hell out of him. Yeah. Keep your head up, Jaden. Work, you know, keep working. Yeah, Jaden was broken. Respect, man. you know what I mean? Yeah, but yeah, yeah. Yeah, Nixon's just a different kind of animal, bro. Yeah. Just broke his spirit. You can tell. The guy's like, fuck, bro. I don't know what to do. Yeah, straight up. Uh, there's nothing yeah. I can do. You know? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, he's yes. a fucking gangster, bro. <laughs> I was just yeah. thinking back, bro. I was just thinking back. He was yeah. just fucking... Oh, man. Just dominated that boy, man. Yeah. Well, we've reached the end now with uh, Luke Bartlett versus Sam, Sam Kemba. Kemba. Yeah. Um, yeah, Luke... I can't remember the fight exactly. I know the leg yeah. kicks. It was, it was yeah. a lot of... Uh, like, you can tell these guys are, are still early in their careers. Yeah. Um, I think he got, this this guy had his Alex Pereira. He had moment. the Alex Pereira. This moment. is the Alex Pereira moment right here. Is it for Luke? For Luke, yeah, yeah, for Luke. Luke got kicked in the balls, balls right? Yeah, and he looked at it, he kind of it same shit. Yeah. though. he adjusted his cup a little bit yeah. and he told him, "I'm good, I'm good, I'm yeah. good." And then he followed him. He stalked yeah, him. Stalked him. One, two, boom! boom. Ends the fight That's right it. there. Lights out. Crazy. It was done. He was. He fell. He, it was he done. Hit him with one ground and punch shot. Yeah. Done. Alex Pereira moment, bro. This it, it's exactly Alex yeah, Pereira and Jamal. Literally. The only difference is Luke should what Luke should have done was yeah, you know, he should have just gone. He just right. said, "Let me cook." Yeah, let, let me, me cook. cook right yeah. Here. Instead, he was yeah, like, yeah, "I, I like this guy." After seeing this fight, I was like, "Man, yeah, I like this." This this was entertaining as fuck. What yeah. a way to start the card. Straight up, this yeah. is a good way to start the yeah. card. So shout out to Luke Bartlett and also Sam Kemba. Sam, Unfortunately, yeah. you have to go out that way, but yeah. hey, That's Luke Bartlett. This is a sport, you know what I mean? But Luke Bartlett, well done, bro. Yeah. Shout out to Luke. Shout out to Luke. Luke Pereira. <laughs> Straight up, Luke Pereira. Luke Pereira. Let's go. But now, nah, hey, Luke. A, Luke better come in in his yeah. next one. <laughs> he better start doing that. <laughs> <laughs> but um, nah. yeah. So that's the that's the end of Shuriken fight series. Shout out to Shuriken fight series. Yeah. Shout out to Jason Sadi and Anna. Another not Jason. Sadi. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> sorry, not just not. Jason Vors Uh yeah, Jason Vorster. My bad. I got, I got mixed up. My bad. My bad. Sorry. No, 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 yeah. Jason um, Vorster. Jason yeah. Vorster and uh, is that Larry Vorster? I think. Yeah. Um. Sorry, my bad. My, I messed that one. No, no, no. But, yeah. Yeah. Jason Worcester. Yeah. Shuriken always putting on beautiful fights, yeah. man. This is this is what we're talking about. And now, and congratulations as well yeah. for, for, for signing on UFC Fight Pass. Straight up. You know what I mean? Now, finally on UFC Fight Pass, the, the pros get to shine now. You know what I mean? Yeah. They have to put their name out there. And yeah, this is this is a beautiful thing because now the pros from here get to fight on, on UFC Fight Pass, get to put their name out there and, you know, potentially... You know, if they keep killing it, they can they can yeah. test their pipeline to get into the UFC. Straight up. You know what I mean? Also showcase our talent on our grassroots talents over here. Yeah. You know what I mean? From from our side of the world. Now we finally got on UFC Fight Pass. Because Australia been had UFC Fight Pass. Eternals on UFC yeah. Fight Pass. Yeah. So they've been showcasing their stuff. We had to go there to showcase our talent. But yeah. now we can showcase in our own backyard on exactly. Shuriken. On, on Shuriken Fight Series. Yeah. And and also on our on our turf, you know what I mean, on, on our promotion on, yeah. on our end, you know what I mean? Yeah. So it's a beautiful thing and um yeah, congratulations to Shuriken for doing that. And shout out to UFC Five Plus, man. Yeah. Trust me, you guys are gonna see some shit. You it's only Straight the up. beginning, it's only the one and, and now they've stepped their game up. They got yeah. so many shows lined up. Oh, they, they put their schedule until oh, really? two thousand twenty five. Yeah, they oh, shit. every like two months there's a Shuriken oh, fight series. Yeah. Let's go. They they yeah, stepped you guys it up. about to see you yeah. guys about to see. This is only this only the beginning. You just seen a little taste yeah. of what the talent is over here. Just wait, they've seen Brando, they've seen John, like 
just just hold up just just let him let's let sure can cook let we him bought, cook we bought the cook just let yeah. us cook we're gonna show you the talent that we got we got so many killers they ain't seen diddy they ain't seen yeah there's yeah, so many yeah. them, they haven't seen you know what i mean on on, on these cards so yeah. just hold up we're gonna cook yeah but yeah shout out to shuriken five shout out to ufc five pass and yeah beautiful card man yeah it was and awesome it was a good yeah. night of fights our backyard's becoming our backyard's been had it you know what i mean but yeah. now we're finally getting that shine yeah you know now hex is coming through yeah to auckland you know what i mean so now we're with our fight scene is starting to grow now which yeah. is beautiful you know what i mean and also um all because uh before you know our ckb guys get a lot of shine always get our shine because yeah. obviously we already have our stars in ufc yeah but now all these other gyms yeah, now they get to bring their talent the, yeah. on the front yeah. lines as well because Straight now we have up. UFC fight pass. MMA, Cole yeah, Moore, all these Shuriken. guys, yeah, you know, all these guys, all these other gyms get to come through and show their talents as well. Yeah, and onto these bigger stages like Hex is coming through now. Now all these other little uh, gyms around as well, they can get to bring their talent and showcase their talents as well. Yeah, um, and also not to mention City Kickboxing as well. We can we can showcase our guys as well. Yeah, the you younger know? guys, yeah, the younger yeah. guys and everyone else that's coming up. All the pros. Yeah. So yeah, beautiful thing, man. I'm excited. I'm excited for the future. I'm excited for to see what's what's up next for the for all our fighters in our backyards, man. Yeah. But yeah, it's been awesome. Um, yeah, that's a wrap. That's My it. name is Kumiv. Lucky King. Lucky King. Peace. Wow.